hey hello there everyone so it's your girl amy from guide the makeup and i am back for another video and as you can read on the title it's a haul video so first of all i have like an announcement like this morning i started my driving lesson so i woke up like early in the morning i thought that we're just gonna talk um chit chat something about um what we're gonna do during the lessons for the things that i'm gonna learn etc etc but i started like my driving this morning i was like whoa so i have like uh, so this card is actually um um it tells here how much i pay and as well as um my schedules i yeah my schedules for uh, my second driving lesson etc etc so i'm definitely very happy about it it's definitely really expensive and i told my husband that damn i can buy like loads of makeup without money but it's all right i mean i'm really excited for driving lesson i've been wanting it since last year but you all know i am busy with my dutch passport and it's on its way also just cross finger that i will get it this year so yes that's the good news and the bad news is that since it's my first day like having this driving lesson i had a headache like it's so painful my it's like there's a needle like going through in my brain like especially on the right side of my brain like going back and forth inside my brain so i know it's really painful as well as my neck so yeah so that's the good news and <clears throat> So I guess let's get started with my haul. So first of all, I didn't buy everything just a day shopping. Um, I buy some of them, most of them like online, and some of them are like stores here in the Netherlands. So without any further ado, let's get started. So the first thing that I'm going to show you is this huge bag. Let's get it on my out of my way. So this is a curling iron from Remington, it's, and this is the Pro Big Curl. So I was so surprised when I get this. It's the curling eyes is huge. So this is it, and um, it's fifty something euro. I don't remember the price. Um, I received it like last week. So there you go. And this is the actual curling iron. As you can see, it's huge. It's is it? It's nineteen millimeter and um but it's all right i mean i love big curls some kind of like a loose type of curl and so i think that this would be perfect and I'm, I'm very excited to try this one i own before like a curling iron but not this big probably the half of the size of this curling iron so i'm excited to try this one um it's a bit pricey than what i thought it would be um and it's in a sale and i got it on a sale for 55 euro i'm not sure about the price and i don't have the receipt anymore throw it away so that's the curling iron don't drop it on the floor and so it comes also with this sort of a booklet where there's an instruction how to use the curling iron there you go so the next part is that i'm going to show you is from the store old crowd fat it's a drug store here in the netherlands and i got a few things because i am um, some of them is excited to try some of them are like i have to back up of the prices and so the first thing is the they mark they mark up i don't know how you pronounce it but i think they mark up sensitive cotton pods so this is the cotton pods that i use to apply my toner and as well as if i use like a um, liquid type of makeup remover this would some this is the cotton pads that i will use it's meant for people who have sensitive skin my skin are very sensitive and it's also oily and i love this one because it's so soft and it doesn't irritate my skin so i have three of them because they're on sale for three uh, gratis. Um, um, if you buy two then you get one for free there you go so the next thing is um, this L'Oreal Elnit Satin 230 degree Celsius heat protection styling spray so there you go 
So I am very curious how this works and this one is meant for like for people who will curl their hair using a curling iron. This is the perfect um, hair spray, hair protecting spray. So I am definitely excited to try this one out because I own something also from Luria but it doesn't work on my hair. It burns my hair, especially the ends of my hair. So I'm pretty excited to try this one. This one is, I think, a new product from L'Oreal because I haven't seen this product or I might be not really looking at their products at all so um, yes there you go i don't know what's the price um the next thing is from adrelon and this is the perf uh, perfect curling booster spray i translate it in english okay so there you go so this one is something that you're gonna spray once you finish curl your hair so this one is you're gonna spray it all over your hair to so I was about to buy L'Oreal instead of Andrelon, but um, L'Oreal has this, um, they don't have like a curling spray. They have like a mousse um, type of thing for your, for your hair. And I don't like that because um, I had it before and um, it's so sticky in the hand and uh, it's, ew. I don't like it so I, I was thinking that like to try the Andrelon hopefully it will work to stay the my curly hair like curl the entire day there you go and the last two things is empty the last two things are from the new collection from Rima London and this is the apocalypse lip locker there you go i got two different shades this one is celestial celestial and the other one is phenomenon so this one is definitely more in a neutral shade and i heard um namaisa that's her username and she she's also a swatches of the all the colors from this line and this is very new to um rima london and this i am definitely super excited to try them out and i'll get back to you how i feel about this um lip gloss one thing if you know the kate moss collection um also from rima london the scent are ex extremely the same they are very identical so if you don't like the scent which is i'm 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 i will be honest i don't like the smell of the kate moss lipstick i don't know it's just me and so that's all about the things that i got and the next things that i'm going to show you are from my favorite makeup brand by far from online which i own a lot of makeups from this brand and the brand that i'm talking about is from beige cosmetics so i ordered a lot of stuff from beige cosmetics which is ridiculous um i'm happy that my husband is so supportive for this and it's a lot bit um he's helping me with certain things you know because you can't buy a leaflet and so let's get started um so let's get started with the brushes so i got a brush roll brush sets probably and there you go it's really pretty it's all white I, I already washed it but i haven't tried it but i would but i but the brush the bristles are definitely really soft so i'm excited to try them i'm collecting loads of brushes because um not all of them would be for myself but also for my clients as i said before um i want to stay hygienic for this type of things i don't want to use same things on my face and same things and use it also to my clients um so this is the pouch and it's kind of like um i think it's it's a, it's a fake leather and um it's definitely very glossy looking and i like it it's it looks like a purse that you know you just can throw in your purse so that's about it and the other um brush roll that i've been wanting to purchase from beige cosmetics is this it's kind of like um oval shape thing it looks so cute and adorable but it's always out of stock so finally finally i got my hands on them so 
it opens like this and there is your eye brushes here i haven't washed them yet i will wash them tonight so there you go i got two four six six brushes in here eye brushes and on the other side you got a face brush how cool is that and you have also a huge mirror which you can definitely see how i film <laughs> so there you go I am such a huge fan of Beach Cosmetics. Um, so the next three brushes are just single brushes that I purchased. And these are eyeliner brush. I got two of them. The other one is a little bit shorter than the other one. And um, this one I guess is natural hair and this one is synthetic. There you go. And the other brush, um, this one is actually like a shading brush also from beige cosmetics all right but i don't use it as a shading brush i use it to contour my nose i already have this brush and i am obsessed with it that i have to have a backup and the last one is a mini kabuki brush which is which they i don't they just included to my order it's a mini kabuki brush it's definitely really soft i will definitely going to try to use it so there you go and the last things are palettes i have the first one that i'm going to show you is the bh duo blush palette there you go Dark <laughs> I hope. so there you go duck poopy this is a video bitch so this is the first palette that i'm going to show you this is again the bh duo blush palette and um this is how the packaging looks like looks like the box there you go i already removed the palette inside because it will take forever so this is the actual palette it's the same size as the what was that again the beige party girl palette and as well as the six or 12 blush palette it's the same size there you go and there is again there's no mirror but it's all right like but these are the color it comes with a plastic cover to protect the blushes so these are the six gorgeous blushes that you can play with so palettes for me is really essential if you are working or doing freelance makeup because you don't need to carry loads of mono or single blushes um, you don't need to carry lots of blushes in your train case so palettes are very handy for me um the next thing or the last thing yeah this is the last thing the box is now empty oh my god so the last thing is the bh day and night palette i've been wanting it if, uh, like last year when it actually came out from beige cosmetics but i haven't got my hands on it because um i went to the philippines for a holiday and it's not handy to order and then <clears throat> you're gonna it will be delivered in your house and you're not home so i did in the last year but this year i did and so there you go beige day and night palette you are all familiar with this palette and it has 60 eyeshadows this is the box and this is the actual palette and it comes again with a huge there's a huge mirror wait a moment there you go so let's remove the plastic cover so there you go i thought that the eyeshadow pants are like same size as the eyeshadows from beige party girl palette but they are really tiny i think this is a same size of this is the same size of a what do you call that um the 88 color palette you you, you remember those spot like super teeny tiny pants i think that this same size i don't know i haven't compared it yet but there you go i'm super excited to play with this eyeshadow so that's the end of my haul and i gonna hang up now because 
I'm super tired and have to work tomorrow again. So that's pretty about it. And um, leave me a feedback or anything that you want to say about this haul. And I will see you all on my next video. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, bye. This one is in shade number eight. And this one is in shade number three. They look kind of similar, but this one is actually, let me open it. I'm going to have like.